Okay, it's recording, so greetings ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to some more Red Dead Revolver. This is part 4 of the playthrough, and the last time we left off, I think we were playing with Annie Stokes. So, let's jump right back into the mix and play on the next chapter, which is Saloon Fight, Chapter 12. Oh yeah, twist that gun around near the adjacent sunset. It's good to be back, motherfuckers. I'm Ocelot, and I know gun <laughs> I'm pumped already. Holy fuck, that guy was buff Bagwell. I got a bottle. Whoa, holy. He just threw that guy like a fucking WWE wrestler. What oh, the fuck? Let me go. <laughs> I gotta protect the lady from getting slaughtered here. Okay. Uh. Whoa, he just threw that. Whoa, he just threw that bitch to a table. I'm sorry guys, I am flabbergasted as to what's going on. Bitches are getting thrown, holes are getting thrown, men are getting thrown. What the fuck is going on? You can get sliced by this bottle though. I think this is the only weapon I have. You be kaye, motherfucker. Ooh. Put the woman down. Man, put the woman down before I shove the nigga knife up your ass. Ah! Okay, this is this is actually pretty fun. <laughs> They're trying to steal the women. Bottles are getting thrown. Oh, get punched, motherfucker! Yeah! Oh, don't you dare throw my bitch! I feel like a crazed. Wild West John, I must protect all the women at all costs because, you know, I'm going to pimp those out later. I really hope you don't get any mission failures for slicing these women by accident. Someone took my health. Oh my. Wait, I got it. I picked it up. Never mind. I was lulled into a false sense of security. Throw it down! These guys are taking a lot of punishment right here. You get shit thrown at me too. Are these guys ever gonna die? And these girls do have health bars, so be aware of this. Ooh, get your ass bottled to death. I'm sorry, I had no clear and clever puns there. Just get bottled. These people are coming out of the woodwork too. Ah! Turn around! Oh, you want you want scrap? You want scrap? Let's scrap. Let's scrap with these bottles. Okay, that guy sort of gravitated in the air. <laughs> Holy shit! What is going on, man? Grab the health hole. Oh wait, there's one more. Yeah, get punched. 
What's my name? It's Red Harlow. Uh, so I assume uh, the women are safe, I think. Unless there's, yeah, there's something popping off upstairs. I wonder, can you throw these bottles? Well, you can go into Dead Eye, apparently. Well, you're pretty good in a fight, stranger. The only problem is you lost your guns and all the rockets. Here you go. Looks like you still got some business with them brothers. They ain't what you call kindly fellas. Open the damn door, woman. Well, good luck to you. But I gotta look out for myself, so this door is getting locked behind. Why in the ever loving name of hell did she not throw me the gun before? I could have used that shit while I was in the middle of this big brawl. Well, looky what we got here. If there's anything I can't stand, it's a varmint what don't know its own business. Excuse me, sir. Are you the living embodiment of yin and yang? Because you look like you are. Let's let's hope I get this right again. Uh, I I still don't know what to do here <laughs> during these duels. I think you pull out the gun with the right analog. See, I'm 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 gunning for it right now. Got him. Oh shit! Go back down. Whoa, you fucking saucy old bastard. I am so glad for this jump cut. I'm so glad because there was some holes in the hot tub and they give you a health bonus in the last section and I didn't know that. So, Colonel Sanders, fuck you and your KFC. You're going fucking down. Gotcha. Right in the chin. Right in your finger licking chin. Go back to fucking fried chicken heaven. Alright. So, for this part, in particular, because I went through this several times, uh, you might want to watch up on that banister because there are guys in the next section. Oh, you got that right. So kill the females with the accordions up their ass on the stage with a bullet promptly near the behind. Oh god, barrels, barrels. The stun locking is so, so, so bad. Well, at least they are stupid in setting each other on fire. That always works to your advantage. So, wow, that is very convenient. <laughs> Yo, they're all burning, man. It's a pot roast. Oh, here we go. The football star. The old ass motherfucker that never made it to Dimba. Oh, you're stunned, sir. Okay, so I think the strategy here is to knock him into the tables. This reminds me of, um... Spider-Man 1 with Rhino, remember that shit? Where he charges you and he hits like these generators and he gets stunned. That reminds me of that because he has to hit these tables. And then you do massive damage on him if he does. I'm gonna try to whittle him down before I hit the last table. There's some chairs over here. I wonder. He connected. Come on. Here we go. Oh shit! Good night, Irene. Ugh. Wait, wait, wait. We can be friends, man. All you gotta do is get me a deluxe pizza, and we're good to go. Come on. <laughs> He's done. Yeah, that's what you get for breaking the WWE wellness policy.
That's enough disturbing the peace for one day. Hand over the weapon. I said hand it over. Disturbing the peace, bitch. I saved y'all lives. Someone such as yourself should know better than to stick his nose where it don't belong. Tell me about the one-armed man. <laughs> What's it to you? He killed my folks. Well, I'll be done. I'd heard rumors you were alive, but never believed it. You're Nate Harlow, son, Ray. Tell me what you know about the death of my family. You see, it all happened about 12 years ago, when the U.S. Cavalry made a little incursion south of the border. This guy sounds like a discount Stephen Bloom. I don't know why. I really don't know why. But uh, Sam is dead. Rest in peace, rest in pepperoni, and we can move on to the next segment. We got some multiplayer characters, but we won't be caring about that. Let's continue on. Whoa, we're playing with a new character, General Diego, huh? You know, I said this on Twitter, but I like the fact that when you play with new characters, this game has different Deadeye modes. As you can see with Annie Stokes, she had that long shot. That was pretty cool. Yeah, I think that is one thing that Revolver has over Redemption, the fact that it has different dead eyes. I wish Redemption had that. It looks like we're in the middle of a war. God. Um Whoa, man. Well then. The only way to solve this war is to be a complete fucking badass and annihilate the whole squad. Whoa! The mortars are going off, people. Let's see. I don't have any dead eye for Diego, though. Man, that sucks. Just as I was giving this game praise over redemption, Diego has no dead eye. <laughs> He has different guns though. Oh my! Whoa. Well, you have been thoroughly annihilated. Martillo de Rios! This is for my Latin bride, I see. Holy shit, the fucking cavalry. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, reload, bitch! Uh, uh. Die, motherfucker! Oh shit! Oh. Come on, come on! Lock and load, friend! You need to weaken the U.S. cannon artillery. Command your battalion to fire by using your flare rifle. Oh, okay. Uh, there's one problem though. I am about to die. Uh, I wish I can grab that up there, but you know, look at this game. Look at this. You see this crap? Just when I need health, that bullshit happens. This is the flare rifle, I guess. Uh, destroy those cannons! I spoke too soon. 
All right, let's retry that. That guy looks like a crazed fucking Beetlejuice. You know the midget fucking rapper? He looks fucking weird. He looks just like that. He looks like he grew like two feet tall though. Oh! Okay! The cannonballs are grazing my huevos right now so I need to climb back up to the bridge and fortify my position. I don't like this part. I really don't. Uh, cause you have to shoot the flares to destroy the cannons. And, uh, other than this piece of cover here, which they're going to destroy, the cannons really hurt. Obviously, but, you know. I think that cutscene saved my ass. No, no, it didn't. <laughs> A little bit of comedy for you guys. Fuck! Ah, this is not a good place to be, man. And the cannons made sure of that. Okay, we are diving in Green Tea Lake again. We have four more to destroy. Let's take it to them. This water slows me down, too. That's a little something to remember, I guess. There's guys down here. Health too. Ivy, back in the game. Oh, holy shit! I thought somebody got blown up there. Oh, time for you clowns to get dogged by the Mexican army. Oh, never mind. I hate this mission, I really do. It's not really uh, the most fun, I would say. Because of these stupid fucking cannons. Okay, can I hit them, please? Hopefully, I hit that one. Oh, God! Down to the nitty gritty. Come on. Two more. Let's conquer it, mamons. One more. One more, baby. Come on, please. So I can get off this dreaded level. Fuck. Ugh. Get up. Get up, bastard, man. Come on. Come on. It's right there. It's right there. Can I hit it? I can't see it. Kill this motherfucker. Yeah, baby. Oh shit, retreat. Woo! Ugh. Oh man, I'm about to die, dude. No, no, please. No. No. No, dude. This level is equivalent to bad chocha covered in Swiss cheese. This level sucks, man. Here we have an escort protection mission here where we have to protect our boys. And I think friendly fire is on. Excellent. So I'm going to switch to the revolver because it's faster. So they're going to plant charges on the bridge and we have to protect them. If both of them dies, it's game over. Got to restart the whole mission from the beginning. Brilliant. Oh, and Juwan is about to be toast. Stop shooting at him, bastard. Hit 
can't kill this guy right here. Jesus. Plant that charge, asshole. Hurry up. I'm gonna be bait here. Headshot, bitch. Whoa! Any day now, fucking grandma, come on! I better get this. Alfonso! Come on, Alfonso. Batman, Alfonso, you got this, man. You're gonna get all the fucking cheerleaders tonight as long as you plant the charges on the bridge. Come on, move it! Come on, I got you covered. Hurry up. No, you don't. Dance, bitch! Oh! Plant the charge, dude. Come on, come on. Hurry up. Holy God. Again, I really don't like this mission. We did it. Yippee Kaye, you motherfuckers. lots of gold more gold than you've ever seen a gold mine and it's just over the border in the territory if you spare my life i can give you half huh. why shouldn't i take all of it because you don't know where it is you better speak fast we need some privacy now tell me more about this gold mine Truth be told, there is one little problem. I only own half the claim. My partner Nate owns the other half. And what if I kill your partner? Then that would make us... partners. Partner. <laughs> Alright, this guy is a scumbag. He just sold his partner of the river. A fortress on wheels. The charges are dropped. If you reckon you can bring him in, dead or well, dead will do. Much obliged. Oh, we can do dead. We can definitely do dead. After all, it is the namesake of the game. Red Dead Revolver. Okay, I got a lot of money for that. Took quite a while, but you know, at least I beat it. And I got a health increase. Superb. Let's continue on. Okay, so, ooh, a fire bottle. Uh, I don't see anything that is worth my while here. Uh, no, I think I'm pretty much done for the most part. Let's rock. Now, actually, let's shop. 
instead of let's rock because oh wait I thought they were gonna take me to another shop but I don't know why I thought that but anyway let's continue Yeah, mountaineering, bitch. There's a map? Whoa. This is like a hub area. Alright. That's cool. This game is pretty linear, but you have this level where you can sort of explore. Huh. I know I don't belong here. But I'm intruding on your fucking property because I can. The Grand Canyon is mine. Huh. So I guess we have to explore a little bit. Uh. I think these guys want some trouble now. Yeah, I can do a little gunplay. This sunlight, though, is very, very jarring to look at. I can't see shit. It's obscuring my vision. <laughs> you hear these guys talking? I hope I get to kill someone because I'm so bored. My god! The sun is like a ray beam to my eyes. A raid? What's this about? Um. Holy crap! Well, it looks like the stagecoach is sort of a boss. We have horse fuckers galore. Come on, bitch. They ain't gonna save you. Oh, here we go. Come on, come on. Target that bitch. Ugh, barely put a dent in it. This thing is real slow, though. That's the drawback. But the odds are tipped in my favor. Whoa! This thing has a Gatlin gun? Fuck! I really wish someone stepped on that. <laughs> that would have been comedy gold. Ah, uh, let me get around. Skinny mini bitch. Taste the lead. Alright. Where's the stagecoach? Uh, I guess if I kill it, maybe I'll get something. Maybe I can progress. Who knows? I do want to kill it, though. Let's reload here. Unless, of course, it's not coming back. Huh. Off the beaten path, maybe. So let me check this map. Oh, there's gold, I think. Well, there's targets. Uh... Let's go this way. Uh, let's go down here. No fall damage, baby. That's how we roll in the video game landscape. So, we're going all the way in. Hmm. Let's go all the way around here. This is a bit far. 
shit, hold on. I see people too. I wish I could take this horse. That would be pretty cool. Unfortunately. Wait, I can. Yeah! Alright. I'm gonna call you Callus. I hate that name. I hope you guys get that reference too. He just. The horse just bitch slapped the man in thin air. Physics, people. Physics. That shit is very crucial and important, and I don't want my horse to careen off the cliff because that'd be a bit too realistic for my taste. Giddy up! Hey, I thought the horse could kill him for a second. I don't know. You know what? I might as well do the job. Just take it slow. Steady. Got him. Alright. Stagecoach is back. Hey man, I got a new pet. Where you at? Oh. Oh. Ooh. Collision? No. No. I got lucky. Oh. Oh, this, the horseback riding is definitely better in Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> it's much better. Because this horse tends to get stuck on stuff. But it's really good for chasing down the stagecoach here, so I can't complain, but still. Redemption, better horseback riding. And this boss is about to eat shit. Oh, getting hot up in here. And that guy clips to the ground. Awesome. I want him alive. I have questions for this one. Take him to the gold mine. Holy shit, that's a fucking Indian! <laughs> oh my god! And uh, one armed Dick Beater McGee. Okay, well, now Red is captured. Excellent. My accuracy sucked there, but man, I swear it's better than the last time. Alright, one more mission, and I guess we can call it quits. Oh, tonight is just crazy. When I get tired, I say crazy shit, so just keep that in mind. Last man gets the gold. Oh wait, I am a fucking Indian! Woo! Woo! I'm a fucking Indian, dude. Look, he's just standing all stoic and cool. He doesn't even have to say a word. Just throw that knife into that fucking post. I'm gonna throw some knives into some fucking heads. Uh-oh, here we go. I will move in the way of the prairie dog. I will show you how I hunt at night. This must be a stealth mission, and it's really dark. You see, that sting that you feel was really the arrow of the serpent. <laughs> I can't, I can't keep up this act. Holy fuck. Yeah, Indians don't swear, but you know... You take that arrow to the knee. Look at this, man. I am a bona fide Indian. I'm about to make my mark in Timbuktu. Look at the totems, man. It's symbolism. Prairie dog is watching over me. And 
and I'm kind of mad these arrows don't kill in one hit. Did anyone see me by chance? No. You don't see anyone. It is my cousin shitting bull. Man, I have a knife. I will shank you. They call it the sacred bow. He has dead eye too. Yo, set them joints on fire. Yeah, baby. Don't play with fire, cocksucker. You always get burned. We don't go to hell. We go to casinos. Oh, you could throw these knives here. Excellent. I can't believe you can play with an Indian in this game. That's pretty cool though. I, I, I just like the fact that you can play with multiple characters in general. Even though uh, I'm tired and all of this is for comedic effect. I mean, really. <laughs> but. And this is pretty cool. His dead eye is essentially just lighting the arrows on fire. Hmm. Uh, this is a big map. Okay, so let's try this path. Unless I already been through here. No. Oh, silent but deadly almost. Oh, whoa! For a second there, my controller died. All right, resuming on. These guys are pretty much dropping like flies. Here we go. Uh, what is back here? Let's see. That was a headshot. That guy's like, what sure is hitting me? I mean, these sharp pains in my spleen. Oh, it's too late. Okay. Oh, crap. Whoa! You shouldn't have kamikaze me like that. Asshole. There you go. I'm going to roam scot free after this. So, where in the hell do we go? This is another exploration map. Which I don't mind, but all this visual right here blocking my vision. I don't like it. These trees, man. Come on, become a fucking porcupine. You know you want to. Put the gun down, bitch. Oh, all right. I think we're on the right trail because there's a lot of enemies there. I wish I could get the drop on them better, but you know. There we go. Let's continue down here. Huh. What do we got? Uh, hmm. Let's try out this creek. Hmm. Anything on this map, it has not proven to be helpful. No, let's continue. I think we're in a new area. What am I doing here? I'm just investigating, you know? Trying to find a new land. And you're interfering, jackass! Oh! 
just burn. You know that Nike product placement? Just do it, just fucking burn. That's my motto. And uh seems I'm taking some of my own advice. <laughs> I don't like oh them flames, they stay up for a long time. I had to remember that. Damn, his dead eye is dangerous to him. That's a first. That was a bump. Well, that's a headshot. <laughs> he doesn't know what's going on. He's like, you know what? Why am I getting juggled? And off the ridge he goes. Where he stops, no one will know. Oh. This is kind of fun, I'm not gonna lie. Just sticking them with arrows. It's a little visceral thrill that comes from that. So... I guess we continue on down here. It's a fucking man lion with the owl on his head. Whoa! God damn, nature, you scary as fuck! You scary as fuck right now, pimpin', and... He sounds like a tiger, too. What is he, fucking king from Tekken? Yo! Who does your audio, champ? Harada? Come on, give me an answer. Give me an answer, bitch. You feeling the heat? Yeah, this is what I think. You and your jungle buddies, you're going straight to hell. Oh shit, oh, where is he? Oh, he got nice. He's not really that hard, though. If I can just burn him, like, again, that'd be pretty cool. Whoa, I'm about to die. Uh, retreat? Shit. I was talking shit, now look at me. Oh, roll. I can't believe it, this fucking man lion. Yes! Whoa! Whoa! Chill out, Wolverine! Fuck it. He wants to go hand to hand now. He was taking these arrows like a champ. Uh, I really wish I had that eye. <laughs> this is a slow, painstaking process. Ooh! Move your Indian ass, come on! This guy is a danger to us. I couldn't get him off my ass. All right, let's try this again. Man, the sacred bow failed me, man. <laughs> you know it's true. Uh, this is a trend that I'm noticing with the bosses in this game. They just It's like the first time Oh, I don't know, the damage is just Weird and inconsistent. I'm just gonna go for headshots all the time. I don't even care. It's the only thing that really works. Filling their bodies full of lead, or arrows in this case, really doesn't do anything. Look! Because I thought I was gonna kill him with the dead eye, the flaming arrows, but that last one didn't really work on him too well. I got his ass now, though. I don't know why I'd be forgetting those headshots, though. Burn, motherfucker, burn! Come on. Time to go hibernate. There you go, you want another one? Wait. 
These aren't really working either. Oh my god. Shit, I missed! God damn it! Oh, well now, I have to get my ass in gear. Come on. Throw that knife. Not into my spine, thank you. Oh. Come on. Damn it. Friggin' iframes. Come on. Hold this loaf, bitch! You and your fucking dead ass owl. Yeah, scalp him for his mother. Okay, and Mr. Grizzly is defeated. So, I think that's enough for today. For Red Dead, at least. And I got Shadow Wolf. Excellent. So, we are going to sign off. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed Part 4 of this playthrough. And once again, I will return for Part 5 of Red Dead Revolver. Take care.